All right, everybody, welcome back. Here we go with some white rice, red beans, and some chicken bites. Y'all, this came out so good. Chicken came out so tender. Here we go. Yep, it's yours truly. So you, can, you could use chicken breast for this recipe. I use chicken tenders, um, and I chop those up in about one inch size um, evenly. I say one inch. It'll cook evenly in your pan, six to eight minutes. So make sure that your pieces are all roughly the same size. Um, go ahead and put that in a bowl with some olive oil, some black pepper, some salt, some lemon pepper seasoning. I put a whole bunch of shit in this. Um, parsley, I'm gonna say it as I see it, because <laughs> it was a lot. Oh, some sazon, some adobo, and mix that all up. Make sure it's evenly distributed throughout the entire chicken. We're gonna get our red beans going. I use red kidney beans for this. I use two cans and I have it in that pot in the back. Heat up your hot skillet with some vegetable oil, butter. And while that is heating up in your pan, you wanna go ahead and start your beans in the back. You can see the fire is on. Get that butter nice and melted. Add in your minced garlic. I love garlic. I also added some garlic paste. Mix that up together. Let it get nice and fragrant. You want to have this on like a medium, medium, low, medium, so you don't burn your butter. Add in your chicken pieces and make sure you don't overcrowd. If you have to do another batch of chicken, do so. But this worked out perfectly fine for me. Just get yourself a big enough pan. And you want to keep sauteing this for about six to eight minutes. Um, you don't want it to fully cook yet because we're going to add our sauce, our glaze in that pan. So it's going to cook again. As you can see, I'm getting my sauce together on the other side. And yeah, we're going to pour that bad boy right in that pan. Recipe on that sauce is on my page. So look for it and you want to give that a good stir make sure it's evenly coated and then we're gonna let this sit for another two to three minutes as you can see that sauce is thickening up that chicken is so tender and juicy. I cannot wait for you guys to try this when you make it. It is so good, so well seasoned. And yeah, once that's done, you're gonna take it off the fire, put that to the side and you get your white rice ready. It's easy to make white rice, very simple. And go ahead and throw your beans and some of the juices, not all of it, inside the pot of white rice and you want to give that a good mix and once you mix it all together and it's evenly coated go ahead and plate and that is it for the video y'all i hope you guys really enjoy this meal it came out so good so juicy so tender the kids loved it i loved it and i know you're gonna love it talk to you later